Having issues with your Blink camera not pushing notifications to your phone. I know I've had similar issues. So in this video, I'll detail all I did in order to finally fix this issue. So welcome to Blink Blink. Let's get started. You might have configured all the settings from the Blink app to enable notifications, but this simply would not work if the device notifications for the Blink app is disabled. In the recent versions of iOS and Android, notifications are treated as a device permission that you can enable optionally. The permission menu is also designed to be non-obtrusive. So if you deny or skip out on the first few times the app pushes the permission dialog, it may not bother asking again. So first check if notifications are enabled for the Blink app on your phone. Now accessing the notifications menu for Android varies according to the skin of Android used on your phone. So even if there are easier methods to access the notifications menu on your Android phone, I will take you through the path that is common across all Android skins. To access the notification menu for the Blink app on Android, open the settings menu and search for apps from the search bar on top. You should see the menu that shows the list of apps on your device. Scroll down to the Blink app and tap on it to enter the app info page. You should see an option for notifications which you can tap and enable. On iOS, the access to the menu is more streamlined. Just open the settings menu and you should see an option for notifications. Tap on it and you should see the list of apps from your device. Navigate to Blink and enable the notifications. Another common scenario as to why your Blink notifications are not being pushed to your phone, there might be an active setting such as Do Not Disturb or a battery optimization setting that might be hindering the notifications. So make sure to turn them off as well and check if your issues persist. One important thing to take note of is that the Blink app will only push motion alerts if the Blink system is armed. In case you're not familiar, a Blink system that is set to armed will detect motion and if it's set to disarmed, it will simply not detect motion. So make sure that your Blink system is set to armed just like arming yourself with Blink content like this by subscribing to our channel. To arm your cameras, open the Blink app on your phone and ensure that the sync module and the cameras are all turned on and connected. Then tap on the armed text on the bottom of the screen to arm all the cameras on your system. If your Blink app shows that your sync module is experiencing issues with connectivity or is straight up not showing as connected, then that explains why you are facing issues in the first place. The Blink sync module is the main communication hub that connects your Blink system with all its connected cameras to the Blink servers. So if your sync module is not working properly, then your Blink cameras is gonna have a really hard time communicating with the Blink servers in order to push motion alerts to the Blink app on your phone. So ensure that your sync module is properly plugged in. Check if both the green and blue LED indicators are stable. If the green light is blinking, then it means that the Blink Sync module can't connect to the Blink servers using the Wi-Fi that you initially pair your device with. This can crop up if your Wi-Fi doesn't have enough coverage to connect to your Sync module or if your Wi-Fi doesn't have internet access. So check your connectivity and bring your Sync module closer to your Wi-Fi. I recommend that you contact your internet service provider if you're facing internet issues in general. If the blue light is blinking, it indicates that your Blink Sync module is in pairing mode, which usually happens when your module has been reset. In such cases, I recommend that you delete your Blink Sync module from the Blink app and pair it again from scratch. Here, I recommend that you start with the factory reset process. Although it's not necessary to reset a module that's already in pairing mode, it can help fix any issues that might have caused this issue. To reset your Blink Sync module, press the reset button on the back for about 5 seconds till the lights in front flash red. Then open the Blink app on your phone and tap on the Sync module offline banner that pops up. Then tap on Delete Sync module. Confirm your selection by scanning the QR code on the back of the Sync module. If the status indicators on your Sync module do not light up even after powering the device, then it could be a hardware issue. The first thing you need to do in such cases is to replace the micro USB cable and perform a power cycle on your sync module. 
A power cycle will help solve any charging related issues with your sync module, refreshing the unit from the inside. To power cycle your Blink sync module, unplug it from power and plug it back in after a minute. If power cycling doesn't work, I recommend that you get in touch with Blink and get your issues sorted. And that's pretty much all I have for you in this video. If you found this video useful, do give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more smart home content.